What is up guys, Moritz here from Section Store. Today we're going to be having a look at this image gallery you can see right here. This is a section you can easily download at section.store, the app we built. Um, here you can see an example which is in live use right now from Pura Vida. And I'd say we just jump right in. The first step is to download the Section Store app and the Shopify App Store. So you can just download it right here. I've done that already. After you've done that, you're going to head on over to the Shopify admin area of your very own Shopify store. Then we're going to go down to apps here, look for section store, easily open it up. Then after that has finished loading, we're going to head on over to sections and the specific sections we will be looking at today is the image grid. Um, as you can see here, it's free, but um, I will change it after this tutorial, maybe in a week or something. So if you're fast and watch the video fast enough, you will see it right away and maybe get it for free. But after that, it's going to be a one-time purchase for $9 and uh, no hidden subscription fees or anything. And yeah, yeah, I already downloaded it and I own it myself. So to actually activate it and use it for your theme, you're going to be head on over to the section area here where you can see all the sections. We're going to scroll all the way down. I have it right here, the image grid. Add it to the Dawn Live theme I'm using. After doing that, you can simply just open up the theme editor and there I show you how you can actually uh, add it for your Shopify store. Alrighty, loading up. Perfect. So the first step is going to be that we actually going to add the section itself. So to find that, you're going to type in SS for section store, and then we're going to look for the image grid. Exactly. There we have it. And there it is. I'll show you how you can add a simple picture right here. Uh, a little um, positive thing about it is that you can directly link it to a product of yours. So first of all, we're going to add an image, just a super random generic one. For this example, we're going to be using that. And then I'll just paste in a super random example of one of the sample products I have in my uh, store for this tutorial. And the title is going to be chairs. And that is basically it already. So that's how you can add a photo in the, in the grid. And I'll just add all the other ones off screen real quick. And then I'll show you how you can do some small customizations to the whole block itself as well. So I'm going to see you in a second. Okay, here we are back once again. I've added all the other pictures to the image grid. And as you can see, it's looking pretty fantastic already. After doing all those customizations, we can do one final one, which is changing the actual height of one block itself. So we're going to maybe pump it up to 400. And as you can see, it got a little bit bigger here. And we can also change the font thickness to bold instead of just leaving it to regular. So for this tutorial, I'm going to leave it right here, save it all up. And in the next step, I'm going to be showing you how it's going to look live. So we're going to head on here, click on view, wait for it to load up. And we should have it right here. Here you have it, your very own image grid for your very own Shopify store done in underneath five minutes. I made a separate video on how you can also use the image grid collection section which lets you link those pictures to a certain collection in your Shopify store. But it's pretty much the same, same. You just have one more option of actually adding uh, the collection you want to be have it linked to. But uh, for this example, I linked it to a simple product. So we can click on it right here. And then it's going to link us to this example product I've been using right here. If you're wondering what that is, that is also sections which are available on section.store. So if you haven't done it already, maybe give us a like for this video, a little follow and check out all our other videos. But that was it from me, Moritz, today. 
I hope you guys found this useful and maybe check out everything we've been doing so far. And yeah, have a nice day, guys. Thank you for watching.